Hey, welcome back to another Car Mechanics Simulator 2015 video. Today, we've got the Bolt Hellcat. I picked this up in auction, I think, for like around 17,000, something like that. And I'm going to make this, I'm going to map this effing thing out to the max. It's going to be killer. We're going to put a new engine in it. We're going to use all performance parts. We're going to see if we can turn this thing into a, a ridiculous car, okay? Kind of reminds me of like a Chevelle SS, right? So, yeah. So, I'm going to start here by swapping out the engine. So, let's go F1. And I'm going to put a V8 two-carb overhead cam supercharged engine in this thing. It's going to cost me $27,000. <laughs> but I got the money. I don't care. All right, let's see what that looks like. There we go. Now, we're obviously going to need a new hood, so let's take this hood off, okay? We don't want that hood on there. So, now, this engine's brand new, so we don't really have to do anything to it, but I'm going to see if we can add some performance parts. So, let's get all the body parts off, because they're all crap. Let's see. Let's, I always like to start with a body. And, uh, again, the whole idea here is just to make this thing look ridiculous. And, to, you know, to add, add some cr some really, really great horsepower to it. So, Or, I should say, increase the horsepower. Door off. Let's go to the back. Tail light off. Trunk off. That's off. Okay, so that's all the piece parts. Let's fix the body. Yep. All right, body's looking good. Okay. Now, let's go to... First, let's take care of our um, our body parts. Now, I'm going to replace the hood, but whatever I can fix here, I want to fix. So, yeah, let's try to fix all this stuff. But I just want the doors, really. So, let's look at our inventory now. All right, so I'm going to keep the doors. Uh, let's see, I don't need this, do I? That's extra from last time. That's extra from last time. That's extra from last time. All right, this is all Hellcat stuff. So I'm going to replace... Uh, yeah, I'm going to replace this. I'm selling that. I don't want that. I'm going to replace... Uh, let's see if there's an advanced bumper, but I'm definitely the headlights I'm replacing. All right, door no, tail lights yes, trunk no. So let's get let's get the doors and the trunks on on there. So let's do assemble. All right, there's the door. Uh, let's do assemble, trunk, and this door. Right. Okay, that's cool. All right, look at that. We've got, we've got the uh, the hood scoop coming out of there for the carburetor. So now let's go to... Let's go over here. Again, I just want to take care of all the body stuff. So let's go to here, and we'll go to the tuner shop. Check out the Hellcat. All right, we want... Which bumper do we want? Front bumper A or B? I think we'll go with A. Okay, so we're going to go with this. This. These headlights. We'll go with headlights A. Rear bumper A, tail lights B. I think that should just about do it, right? So let's see if we got everything we need. So, oh, we need the fender, don't we? We need a fender. Did I throw away the fender? God damn it. Oh, I couldn't fix it. All right, we'll take that later. So let's go to assemble. I'll move up a little bit here. Go to assemble. Hood. Yep. There we go. Beauty. Go in the front. Assemble. All right, helps if I have. There you go. Headlight. Yup. Bumper. Uh, we're gonna go with A, right? Yeah. And we're gonna go here. Yup. Let's go to the back now. Those are cool looking. Those are cool looking uh, lights. 
All right, did we get her tail light? Yep. Bumper and our rear tail light. All right, let's go back here. We're going right tail light. Right. Okay, well, well let's get take care of that. Then we got to get our two. Um, we have to get our fenders. Oh, did I, I put the rear bumper on? So we have to get two fenders, right? Right and left fenders. Just make sure. Yeah. So let's go to the body shop again. We have to go to the regular body shop for that. Hellcat, left fender. Hellcat, right fender. All right. We'll assemble. Yep. And we'll save the painting for last, like I usually do. All right, now our body's complete. Okay. Like the chrome there around the wheels. So now, I think we strip everything down. And what we're going to do is uh, fix all the suspension and the wheels and stuff. Let's take a look at the motor. Hmm. I mean, it's all new, but I can upgrade a lot of this stuff, which I'm going to do. So let's just check our value right now. So right now we increased the value to 42. We were at 14, and we really haven't put anything in it except for some body parts and a $27,000 engine. So we want to get everything off the car, fix everything we can, and then we're going to replace with performance parts. So let's start. And I'm going to rip the whole engine apart, too. Why not, right? So let's get it up on the... Uh And we'll start with the back wheel. Let's do our thing. I'm not going to replace the engine block. Did I have everything on here? Let me just see. I think Did I get the camshaft out and everything? Yeah. So I'm, I'm going to just leave the engine block there. I'm not replacing that. So um, let's take a look, man. We've got a lot of stuff. Mm -hmm. Let's look at condition. Now the whole idea here is um, we're going to keep... We're going to try to fix the non-engine parts. Because the engine's brand new. So we're just going to replace the performance engine parts, right? So let's um, let's get to the workbench, which is where we are, all right? And let's repair. All right, let's take a look now. All right, we got some crap that we have to replace, unfortunately, because we couldn't repair it, but most of the stuff is in pretty good shape. So 
what I'm going to do now is, I don't, and the good thing is I don't have to buy these because they're all new, the push rods and rocker arms and stuff. I'm going to go through here, and I'm not going to get new rims. I'm going to go with the, those chrome rims. We'll stay with those. But let's go through this. I'm going to go through this and then pick up the inventory that I need to pick up, and we're going to go through and get all the performance parts for the engine. All right, so I'll be right back. Alrighty, welcome back. Well, I went through and I upgraded all the body parts that need, or the uh, suspension parts that needed to be upgraded, uh, not upgraded, purchased. And now I'm going to go through and I'm going to maximize the performance of the engine. Okay, so let's take a look at performance shop. Let's see what I can do. Do I have a camshaft? I don't have a camshaft. I think I can buy two. I can't. This camshaft's not going to work for me. But I can get two four barrels. Let's just check here. Yeah, two four barrels. Oh crap, wrong place. Go over here. Two of these. Okay. So that upgrades that. The alternator. Forgot about that. Alternator. Just adding horsepower. Crankshaft? I don't think, but let's just check. No. Crankshaft, no. But yeah, the clutch plates I can do. Yeah, let's see there. The engine heads, V8 uh, overhead valve. Let's see if we got those engine heads. V8, you see, that's going to add 8 horsepower, so we're going to go with two of those. Let's see, where are we? Engine heads. Get rid of these two. I know the exhaust manifolds we can do. Exhaust manifolds right here, two of these. Doesn't add much, but it's real chromed out, so that'll be kind of cool. Fuel pump and fuel filter, yes, we can do those two. Uh, fuel pump, fuel filter. Fuel pump. Uh, let's see. Let me go back here. Fuel pump, fuel filter. Sell these off. Um, ignition, all that stuff. The distributor cap can do that stuff. Let's see, where is that? This guy. Distributor cap. We want wires. Like that. Those cool red wires. I know the pistons we can replace. Let's take a look at our. Yep, yeah, we're going to need eight of those. Alright. Sell the old ones back. Didn't get much for them, but that's okay. With spark plugs, we want eight of those. Uh, I think that's just gonna just about do it. Let's get rid of these old spark plugs. It is a brand new engine, so. Starter, supercharger, no. Ross water pump. Uh, let's see if we can place the water pump. Mm, don't see the water pump. All right. So let's. That's that for that the engine. All right. Good. So let's go back to the inventory. Uh, let's look at exhaust. We're gonna replace all this stuff. All of it. So front exhaust pipes. Um, this guy. Two of these. We want two middles. Oop, crap, cat, we don't want that. Two middles. I know we want two middle mufflers. Let's just make sure we got the right, uh... Two rear muff V8 uh, overhead rears. So let's look at those. 
two of these. I think that's just gonna just about do it. I gotta replace one rim, I think. Alright, good. So let's look at all. Alright, so there's a rim I have to replace. I'm not sure why they don't have a, a, a V8 overhead camshaft in the in the performance part. It's kinda weird. Where's the wheels? Where's the wheels? Where's the wheels? Okay, I need a classic rim eight, right? So let's go to the wind room shop, classic rim eight. Eight. Good. And that should just about do it, right? What we're gonna do now is we'll start with the suspension again and stuff, the tires and suspension. I'll go through that quick and then we'll uh and then we will go to um We'll go to normal speed when we're back doing the engine, so let's get to it. Pretty much finished all the mundane parts, and now we're getting into the performance stuff. Let's get the battery on there. There's no performance battery, but definitely performance pistons. Get those on there. They're so tricky sometimes. You know, I should have dynoed this thing before. Ah, you know what? That's next time I'm going to do that. That's kind of a mistake. I should dyno it before to get the horsepower before and after. Yeah, that's what we should start doing. All right, I'll remember to do that next time. But until then, we're building this thing up to something ridiculous, hopefully. Uh, Because we started with like 236 and now we're at 194, so we've spent a lot of money. About four, over $40,000. Because we spent 27000 on an engine. And then we bought all these performance parts, you know, to increase the horsepower. So maybe we might have gone over I might have gone overboard with this. We'll see. We'll see. That's okay. It's only a game and it's not real money. My bet is I'm gonna be able to sell this thing for like a hundred and two thousand or something like that. Uh, these stupid pins are pain in the ass. They are such a pain in the ass, these pins. Got a power throw.
Alright, that's that. Put that on. That on. Alright, let's spin around here. And put the pins in. The pain in the ass pins. Push rods. things in. wonder if real life there's such a pain in the ass, too. Maybe. cover. Alright, let's get that on there. Swing around, get the other head cover on. Distributor and stuff on. Why can't it? Where's the distributor? Where? Uh, come on. What am I doing here? Um, Alright, put that on. Not sure why I can't put the distributor on. It's weird. That's not on. That's uh, that makes sense. Okay. Um. These stupid clips are a total pain in the ass. There it is. Nice looking carb. That's it, and some horsepower. I think it's like eight horsepower just by those two things. Right, air filter. And scoop. Alright, let's do the servo. And let's see what else. We've got the timing stuff, right? Cam gear, timing chain, uh, timing cover. It starts to get a little tight in here. Get all this belt and crap on. Water pump. Probably could have. I could have changed that power steering. I think too. That's all right. Might have made it a little easier, but on the drag strip. Let's get this. Yeah. All right. Uh, here.
should just about do it. Let's look at our inventory. That, that's always a sure tell sign. Oh, that's the old clutch plates, right? We forgot the oil pan, so we gotta do that on uh, oil pan, fill it with oil, and then we should be good to go. Let's see here, assembly mode. There it is. All right, that should be it. So now let's get it off the get it down, put some earl in it. Looking pretty nice here. Let's check it out here. Let's look at our value now. 75k. I mean, we're going to make money on it, but I thought it was going to be more than that. We got 100% body, 100% parts. That's good. So let's uh, so let's go tune this puppy up now. Move it to the dyno. Carburetor tuning. Well, yeah, it's incorrect, but it's pretty close. Get it right. Boom. Let's get it right in here. Pretty close. Alright, 642 horsepower, not bad. I would guess it was probably around 300 before, maybe 320, something like that. So, pretty happy with that. So let's take it back to the garage. Alright, let's take a look. Now we're going to paint it. Looks nice with that scoop, doesn't it? Really nice. Got to figure out a color now. Let's see, let's go to the paint shop. Definitely not that color. I like brighter colors. Not orange.
Not pink. Purple might be cool. I got too many red cars. I mean, it would look great in red, but... Alright, let's go green. Let's do a green. That looks pretty cool. Let's try that. Yeah, let's go. <laughs> looks pretty sick. That looks pretty sick. Alright, let's take it to the uh, drag. that hood up. Let's get our camera on. Get the right move here. That looks pretty cool. Alright. Let's close the hood. Drag race time. Let's go. All right, here we go. Ready? Whoa, that's not cool. Let's try that again. All righty, here we go, ready? So touchy. Oh, the steering is so touchy. It's almost impossible to try to, to steer this thing, man. I'll try one more time. All right, we'll try one more time here. to, I forget, 240 or something. Anyway, <laughs> let's go back to the garage. <laughs> Alrighty, well, let's take a look at our final specs here. So, 75K, 242 horsepower. Best time was 14 second quarter mile. We gained 12% by chip and carb uh, carburetor tuning, or carburetor tuning. There's no chips in this car. So, we're going to make some money. I think we started with 236. So we'll make a decent chunk of money here. Not a great amount, but a decent chunk of money. I am going to sell this car. Because we'll use the money for something else. And that's at 268. So I think we started with 236, or I can't remember. But anyway, it was fun to do. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Hit the like button if you like what you saw today. And don't forget to subscribe to... Bambino Games for more Cars Mechanics Simulator 2015. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.